everything is dead is good. Well, that's not true. God told his disciples to give up all the riches, all the houses, and all everything that they had and come and follow him. As well as he, the mother that asked God, could her son drink of the cup that he drank of? And he asked her, are you sure, positive, that your son could drink of this cup? Because there's so much pain and suffering to go along with that cup. But people nowadays want to teach that if you know God that you're going to be wealthy, you're going to be rich, you're going, you're going to have everything. Well, there is pain when you carry that cross. Did Jesus not suffer when he carried the cross? Yes, he did. We're going to suffer. But the reward is in the end. God said, I'm coming back to get my people. And I'm bringing what? My reward with me. The war, my reward with me, the crown he bringing with him. Your reward is in the end. You got to fight the battle right now. That's right. You're going to fight the battle now. And you fight the battle to the end and you get your reward in the end. You don't have no reward now. Uh, 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 if you think you're going to get your reward now and you think you're going to live good and, and, and everything's going to be uh, peaches and cream and you, you're going to get a reward in the end, I, I don't know. I don't know where you got that from. I, I, I don't know where you read it in the Bible that you're going to get all, all heaven in here and then you're going to get heaven again at the end. I don't know what Bible you read that in, but if you fight a good battle right now, then heaven and the reward is all at the end. Then you're going to live eternity and joy, happiness, and, and no more pain, no more suffering. Your reward is at the end. So whatever your suffering is, whatever situation you're going through right now, God will see you through because if he brought you to it, he'll bring you through it. He'll bring you through it. Yes, Amen he on will. That. And so remember that and keep your trust in him because he's the only one that will help you and give you that peace that surpasses all understanding. So please let your heart say yes to Jesus. Yes. And every time you go through a little suffering, just think about Jesus suffer for me. For me, and he suffer a lot more than I'm suffering. That's right, and you heard that right here on LPJ. Love, Love, peace, peace, and and joy. joy.
Thank you.